All right, folks, G Baker here, Jessica here as well. And we are going over the buzz count drill. Again, this used to be originally a 15 count. It's now been boosted to a 25 count. By the time I film, the, film this series, it could be at like a 10,000 count. I don't know, okay? Basically what we're trying to do is create fluidity of movement, understand openings and understand strikes, and really being able to practice the, all the strikes that you have learned throughout this course. So this is a really good review of different strikes, different mechanics, different concepts which is why we don't learn this early. This is again to help you refine some of those things. Okay, so she throws, step out of line, boom, get a kick in, bam, get an elbow and get my Fonza rally in, right? Here, I'm gonna get my stomp kick in, bam, here, get my punch in, okay? The next thing what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my thumb, right, and I'm gonna insert it below here. Okay, this, and when you, when you get it done to you, you're gonna know it doesn't feel well. So it's gonna go right up into those glands up there, right? The glands that the doctor checks to see if they're all puffy, right? So I'm doing a gland check here, like that. The next thing I do, see, see where this finger is? Is this is gonna become an eye rake, right? So I'm gonna sweep here and dig right into her eye. Okay, <laughs> she loves it so much, right? And then, after that, what I'm gonna do, and this is, this is very fun, kung fu -y, this is kind of very Filipino, is that I'm gonna scoop this arm here, right here, and then I'm gonna come in and do another vertical elbow. This could be to the armpit, right here, depending on the orientation, it could be to her sternum, or it could be up to her chin line. You get to decide, it basically depends on the position you're in here. So from here, I'm gonna come in, I'm gonna go for the chin, watch this. Boom, here, right up to that chin. Okay, you notice again, I've shielded myself. I've done another Fonzarelli thing here. I wanna shield myself here. So just in case, maybe that, right, maybe she ducks out, right? And then she comes in for a strike, right? I want that shield up. If your head, your computer gets shut down, everything else fails. She could go for a rib shot, but getting punched in the ribs is way better than getting punched in the head or the neck. Okay, and if you don't believe me, I'm sure Jessica will oblige by, you can come on over here and she'll strike you in all three and you can choose which one is the least desirable, okay? She likes that kind of stuff. Okay, again, she throws that punch, a step off, boom, get kicking, bam, switch, Fonzarelli, cool, here, right? Get that kick in, bam, get the punch in, boom, here. I'm gonna take this thumb here, scoop it to here, right? Then I get that eye rake, whoosh, here like that, then I'm gonna take my left hand, right? And now this is when I let go of this. I come here, but you notice I don't let go until it's here, right? I'm gonna step here and come up, bam. Right? So it's this little, um, you'll see it a lot in, in Filipino martial arts, these different kind of scooping things. You'll see a little bit of it in, in Muay Thai as well, but I would say it's more a Kali or C-Lot maneuver. Again, I'm scooping under to open that up here and getting that shot in. And also, again, I'm protecting. I've got good protection up top. I'm scooping, bam, and getting that little shot in here. So you can practice it coming up and over, up, boom, here. And remember that little fonz really, right? Like that. Scoop. We're gonna do this one more time and then I'm gonna have Jessica do this. Okay, so again, I'm here, I step off line, I smash, I kick, I elbow, right? I get another kick in and I get that punch in. Now I'm gonna insert my thumb up into the glance to make sure she's not sick. And then the sweeper eyeball. So she's got like a, I don't know, like a splinter in there. I sweep that out like that. Again, I'm gonna scoop here. I'm gonna step with my right foot here. I'm gonna scoop here. Turn and bam, up right there. Okay, we're gonna talk you through it. She's gonna do this three times. Punch, bam, kick, bam, lop style, elbow, bam, left foot kick, bam, left punch, boom. Now she's gonna insert her thumb right into that gland, right? Go ahead, just make me suffer. There you go, ah, oh, fudge nickels. Okay, then eye sweep, oh. So she starts to eye sweep this way. What happens to her advantage is that, again, something like this, 
you're not gonna dig into it, right? She starts to sweep like that, and you're just gonna turn here, right? So she comes up here, right? And then crack, right? Again, depending on the placement, maybe I'm open like that, nice sternum blow to knock the wind out of me, right? Um, those of you who are really flexible and low, maybe it's a growing, maybe it's a growing elbow. I don't know. Um, that's not your growing elbow tonight, okay. but yeah. All right. So, boom, kick, bam, sweeping elbow, boom, left kick, kick, left punch, boom, insert that thumb, oh, eye sweep, boom, then scoop. Yep. So scoop like that. Boom. And up. Oh, yep. So the scoop, think of again like like I don't know, you're doing a little funny dance. Whoop, whoop, whoop. So she throws a, throws a punch, right? And it's scooping down here. Okay, so you're coming up and over and scooping through. Just like 31 flavors. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Boom, bam, kick, then lops out elbow, boom, then right kick, or left kick, boom, left punch, boom, right to the glands, here, sweep, here, and scoop, and elbow, good. Again, the idea, throw a punch, right, is I get to here. After here, after I get that punch in, instead of snapping it, I could punch and think of like you're trying to send her head off into oblivion. I punch, boom, from here, I'm gonna keep my hand out and keep and maintain her off balance as well as, again, a sensitive area. And if, if this area isn't sensitive to you, God loves you, I don't know. But uh, uh, the idea, again, is you're taking this and you're digging it. You're digging, digging, digging. And when we're training, we're doing it fairly soft, but this could even be, right, here. This could be a very forceful strike, like an eagle claw, right, here, right? Right now, I'm hitting here and just putting a little bit of pressure there, but this really could be here and me jamming in, boom, like that, right? And then, again, this scraping, digging in, Right, so I've just jammed my thumb in and then I'm scraping her eyeball out. And again, I could scrape her eyeball this way or like what we kind of came up with better is maybe scraping it this way. It's really up to you which way you like, like wax on, wax off, wax on, wax off, you know, all that good stuff. Okay, let's have her do it twice more. So, boom, elbow, bam, kick. Good, lops out, elbow, boom, then left kick. Then punch to the head, boom, then gland check, right? Then scrape, then elbow up. Oh, I didn't even feel good. All right, one more time. It's like, hee hee, yeah. That's why we train, feel the pain. Bam, kick, boom, elbow, bam, left kick, boom, punch, gland, oh, eye, Ugh. and bam. Okay, makes sense? So again, the, the idea is uh, you will never do this sequence. So don't think like, oh, I learned this sequence in class and it thinks epic and I'm this. No, the idea is she throws a punch and also I'm up here. From here, what do I do? Oh, I stick my finger there. I scrape here, right? I scoop to the inside, right? That's one option. Again, I could go here. I could go to here. And because I haven't gotten to destroy her elbow yet, then I come here, right? So you're starting to learn based on positioning what is available to you. First, the idea is you learn the basic mechanics, then you start to perform the mechanics, then you start to adapt the mechanics, right? So what I'm teaching you, again, the reason why I don't call it a technique is because in live situations, this is not gonna be available in this sequence. But what you're gonna do is you're gonna learn enough of it that you can be creative about where you are and where you find it. She throws a punch here, right? I come here and all of a sudden I'm doing that gland blow because that's what I learned, right? So again, instead of going here, I'm gonna take it into here, right? And then I'm gonna do an over the hand elbow like that, right? So again, how to be creative with these concepts. That's what it's all about. All right.